spa day. Yay! We got sauna, steam shower, zero gravity chairs in there, and now we're going to the hot tubs. After a fabulous time at the spa, we are now in Toby Keep's bar and grill for some lunch. Hey, okay. On day four of the Chili Bowl Nationals. <laughs> it is now quarter to two. We have ordered our food and everyone is currently sharing their vlogs. Hey. Look at the video. There's only two people. The manly drinks on this side of it. A little bit of a I don't know what he's got. Feminine drinks. Feminine drinks. <laughs> I wasn't gonna put that in there, really, but <laughs> this is the star of Manny Pouch's vlog, Dan Lamar. So yep, Dan himself. <laughs> We're not really sure what else you're supposed to do in Oklahoma other than uh, cowboy boot shopping. Anyone? So I have no idea why this even works. Liquor store is here, but then if you want to buy domestic beer, you go in that room. Is that how this works? Like, someone explain this to us. The one side of the liquor store has the lower alcohol content, and the other side has the higher alcohol content. And I don't know why some of the, the regular domestic beers you can't you can't buy them in the regular liquor store. So weird. So weird. What do we got? Mike? No joke guys, we are currently in Target. Um, we had such good seats that it's going to get so crowded that you know what? We left Dan and Mike to hold our seats and we're running to Target to get sheets to lay down so we don't lose any seats because it is so packed. And luckily, Target's like half a mile down the road. I feel crazy right now. All right, a couple people are a little bit jealous here. Probably wouldn't have been a bad idea to actually offer a couple people to grab them some sheets. me was that every single night this week as soon as they start the national anthem everyone drops what they're doing and stands and it just I've never heard the pits so quiet before it like it kind of almost gives you chills it's pretty incredible all right so I'm here with Kevin Woody and he has been our neighbor all week here in the pits and you said it's your first time to the Chili Bowl. You've raced only one other time in a midget. Yes. How, what do you think? One other time in a midget. Um, it was at Ducoin on December 16th. I think I was like already first in like a 56 car field, but it's really to be expected. Um, it was a great experience. I learned a lot coming here um, to the Chili Bowl. I, I, at home, we used to run a 270 micro sprint. It's a big jump. Um, the hardest thing for me has been, has been the braking on entry and the difference in the two race cars. Okay. Now, what interested me was that uh, not only is this his first Chili Bowl, second time in a midget, but you said you were in the Army. Oh, uh, yes. And you bought a race car as soon as you got out. As soon as I got out. I was in the Army from 2009 2013. I was Airborne Infantry. I, I did a one tour in Iraq in 2012. That was for 10 months. I enjoyed that, that very much. Um, but, um, but I've always been a fan of racing since I was nine years old. I got the Army, I was maybe 26, and so it, it was time to start racing. I saved money, went deployment, and I, and, I bought, and I bought the micro sprint. And I mean, I've been doing that every year since I was 13. All right, and you're from New York, so... Or Rochester, New York. 
our neck of the woods over here. Again, the East again. Coast, yes. But another thing that intrigued me too is what you do for a living. I do for a living, yes. Actually, I, actually, I, I'm an armed bodyguard and, and I work in Baghdad, which is in Iraq, of course. I've been doing that for two years and also I enjoyed, enjoyed that very much as well. That's, that's pretty crazy. Yes, I mean, that sounds like a lot of traveling. It, it is a lot of traveling, but so it, the way it goes is I'll, it, is I'll work for about three months and I'll have maybe like a, a month off work. So. So I'm looking at the schedule this year, and, and the Chili Bowl is always in January. So I saw I, I saw that um, I saw my vacation it was during the time. I was like, oh, I'm doing the Chili Bowl. Oh, I found a ride with um, uh, uh, Steve Buckwalter, and it's been great. And, and the car's been in one piece all night. It's yep. been, uh, been on the ground all four tires the whole week. So I, I, I like that. It's been, it's been fun so far. All right, guys. Well, make sure to check him out. Kevin Woody. Thank you very much. No, I'm going to say, it's a Buffy and Swanee. I found your son. Taking good care of him. <laughs> you know, it always absolutely blows my mind the amount of people that come up to us and are like, oh my god, we watch your videos. And just how diverse they are. You know, the different states. and It's just incredible. I and think it's cool what, other, what different people take out of them. You know, everybody sees it a different so way, guys, too. For some reason we're smudgy. Don't mind the smudge. Some people watch the whole thing. Sometimes they don't have time. Yeah. But, but uh, what was really neat too, um, another one to add in, Steve. This is a shout out to him. He does marketing for the Hard Rock Casino, which is where we're staying at. And he watches our videos. Small world, but big world. It's pretty awesome. So Steve, thank you. We're about to walk by their tent. You want uh, to yes, in? absolutely. So make sure to stay at the Hard Rock Casino. Go gamble at the Hard Rock Casino and the spa. Top notch. She's not just saying that. It's actually a really nice hotel and it's fun place to stay. And it's not a big commute to get here from there. Steve, hey, what do we got? Hey, hi, Mandy. Hi, Mike. Hi. How are you? The difference? Is it recording? Yeah, it's recording. Oh, it is. But it's upside down. It, it'll big? flip. It'll flip. Oh my God. Come on. Okay, so Look over. You. What? Okay. She's not gonna cut this. Up. Nope. <laughs> Got ice cream. Ice cream again. Yep. Good stuff. Um, this may be bad for my health. I'm not. A, I'm not. I wouldn't say I'm lactose intolerant, but but ice cream doesn't really agree with my stomach in large sums. Me neither. So I uh, eat it. <laughs> you either, but you eat it like. Every day. Like it's an everyday thing. It is good though. I will say that. But 
uh, you can't just sit anywhere in the back stretch now. We're limited to just turn two. We used to be able to sit in turn three. Now you got to have a pink wristband to sit in it's turn tight. three. Like the, the security has gone up, but the excitement level has gone up as well, too. I mean, there was when Meserol won his A qualifier, the stands the over there section, the went stretch. nuts. I mean, they went crazy, and he could. I think he could hear them in the car. Like he, you could see with the hand signals he was putting out the car that he could hear the crowd. That's how. That's how rowdy it got. It's yeah. pretty impressive. It's definitely filling in, and I can't even imagine tomorrow. We'll probably be watching in the pits. So, yeah. <laughs> I hope we can get a seat because I don't want to watch this on the screen. I mean, this is my first time here. I want to see it in person. I wish I spent the money to buy a seat, honestly, but. Uh, not that easy to get. Okay, so tip to all the women that keep going like this. All you have to do is hold it. Amazing, I know, right? We're packed in like sardines, but it's feature time. Hey guys, I just got here. Are the feature did the features start yet? <laughs> did the features start? <laughs> if you're gonna jump in, at least comment. Come on, what did you think? What did you think? The features, man, they just came down. Oh, it was great. What, what are all uh, these doing here? <laughs> okay, I give Justin Grant uh, like a ton of credit because he ran his butt off, and you know what? He's worked for as far as he's gotten, and I'm impressed. I thought it was a very good race. Packed. I'm really nervous for tomorrow. And um, my BFF from, you know, New Jersey growing up, we buried his rabbit together. And um, Mandy's dead pet, dead pet therapy service. Yes, I'm gonna have that now. That's that's a new one. Anyone, let me know. Shout out to uh, the Dirt Modified drivers from the Northeast, uh, Timmy McCready and Billy Pouch Jr., who both finished seventh in the A main, which means they're pretty much starting side by side. Tomorrow's B main, so hopefully they can both make the A main, which will make all the dirt modified, big block dirt modified drivers proud. Uh, not any of this Imca stuff or Ump stuff, actual big block 467 modifieds that are from the Northeast, which we're really proud of. Not any, they don't know them, no, they don't know about them out here. No, they do not. No, so he uh, he also talks for a living and breathes fires, so uh, we'll have to touch base on that. Tomorrow. And she works at Fulton Bay. <laughs> I do. Can't say that. Why not? Are you dressed up for being at a racetrack? I mean, maybe a little bit. The leather jacket, the scarf, but the whatever. Scarf. <laughs> but it's clean here. It's not that dusty. No, no. it was. There's it a little bit of crowded. smog from the fumes from the engine, but it doesn't get dusty. By the way, um, our spa. It was so great today that I think we kind of got a really lazy start, and we were very uh, tired. I mean, I was sleepy all day. So. I wanted to take a nap. But once we, once you enter this building, the energy kind of takes over and it gets you amped up again. I think it's, it's. We needed to get out of the hotel quicker. And we need to get out of here because <laughs> they're turning the evacuating. Out. See you tomorrow. Bye. Yeah. Thanks for Thanks. watching. Shout out to all my fans. <laughs> Subscribe. Like Hop videos. on down. Stop on by. Don't walk past when you should have, could have, would have. And you can come on over here and hang out with this amazing woman. If there ever was an angel that fell from heaven, this would be that angel. If you look at her back, you can see the two bumps where her wings used to be. She's American as apple pie and sweet as a candy cane company. She hypnotizes helpless humans, hurling hoops with hips and hands. And we're here with the third place finisher of the Eastern States <laughs> 2017. Yes! Ladies and gentlemen, Thank buy his shocks. Buy everything. He's actually coming out with towels. Mike Mahaney towels coming yeah. soon. <laughs> See you tomorrow.